Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Dun dun dun. My name is Yefri, Y E F R I, and this is my first YouTube video. Today I filmed this look for you guys. It is this glowy, this golden, goddessy peach look um, using ColourPop eyeshadows and, you know, a few other different products. I hope you guys like this tutorial, like this video, and I hope you guys stay here with me for this journey, which I'm super excited for. And yeah, let's get to the tutorial. I'm going to go ahead and put on foundation. So my favorite brand for this is 100% Pure. They're amazing. I love, love, girl, I love their foundation. This is the fruit, super fruits, healthy foundation. It's made out of like fruits and stuff. If you're wondering, outright. I am in the shade Golden Peach, girl. I'm golden and I'm peachy. Right, so uh, I'm going to use the W. I always start with W. I'm going to use the SW Basics there. Cream. This is another one of my favorite things in the world. So I'm going to take a little bit. A little bit goes a long way. So I'm going to take some of this. Put it on the back of my hand. It's solid, but you know warm it up with your fingers and then I'm gonna get my foundation and put like that much right and then I like to go ahead and take my foundation brush so then it becomes very 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 less matte and more dewy so I like to just put it on my face put it on my Face. Gotta paint, gotta paint, paint, paint. So I'm gonna take a very ripped up beauty sponge. It's, it's by Ulta. Uh, and it's very, I ripped it. I was washing it and I, you know, have nails. And at the time those nails were like extremely sharp, sharper than these. So I was just kind of going like this and it just tore and I was like, oh. But no, it's okay. I'm actually gonna go ahead and kind of have my eyes ready like prime them off camera and I'll be right back all right guys so I'm back <laughs> and I primed my lids so I know I look a little bit crazy right now I have extremely oily eyelids so it's not fun and I have to do take a lot of steps to prime them today I'm going to use mostly ColourPop eyeshadows I ordered these this is not like a actual palette you know how they have they're already kind of put together palettes these are just single eyeshadows that i chose all right so the brush i'm going to use is by luxy 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 it is the 227 blending brush lord no well, it looks like this and we are actually going to go ahead and start with iou just a little bit just a I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and have this as my transition color. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna go ahead and take this shade right here it is flower boy I believe it's like this pinky peach it's a very nice color with the same brush by the way so we would have to kind of concentrate a little bit more on the outer V it's a little bit you don't want to make it pink because this is a little bit more on the pink side rather than the like the orange peach side a light lightly right here but I might say concentrated on the outer V right there
This is by BH Cosmetic. This is like from their studded couture line. So I'm going to go ahead and take this shade. It is called Paper Tiger. It is one of my favorite shades. Oh my gosh. So we're just going to go ahead and put it right there where, I, where, you know, where we left that empty space. Put it right and this is just to kind of like have some dimension. Don't worry about blending right now because we'll do that last. We're gonna blend, girl. We're gonna blend. The first thing we have to do is we have to conceal these pups. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the tarp, 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 the tart shape tape concealer in the shade and the shade light medium honey i apologize for this light oh my gosh so just first and then kind of clean clean it girl Ooh. Yes. Let's jump to the next part. So for my inner corners, I'm actually going to go ahead and go to the Urban Decay Electric Palette. It was one of my favorite freaking eyeshadow palettes of the entire world. So I'm going to go ahead and go and with the shade Revolt, which is this shade right here. Oh, it's a detailer brush by Real Techniques. It's very cute, very, very small. And we are gonna go ahead and put it on the inner corner. The inner corner. <laughs> There it goes, and it's just oh, so pretty. Let's go ahead and take it just a little bit higher, but like I like to just a very light hand as I go higher. So it's like the letters like fading into the eyes and stuff. The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take one of my favorite products. That I feel like no one ever talks about and it's just like why are you talking about that it is by anastasia beverly hills it is their metallic luster liner i have it in the shade liquid gold oh girl Ooh. if you want something metallic beautiful and long wearing because this does not come off it this is it it's it is super super gorgeous oh my gosh before i use that i'm actually gonna go ahead and go back to paper tiger again that mustard color go back to that and i'm gonna try and mimic what i have going up going on up there just a little bit Okay, so then we're gonna have to take this magical, magical pencil and put it on the lower lash line. I'm taking it all the way up, girl. I am taking it all the way up. And then right where we have that gold, we're just gonna tap it so it can like blend with the silver. Just tap it just a little bit. Oh, yes, yes, yes. And then on the outer corner, 
I'm actually gonna go ahead and put some more. I mean, not some more, but I'm, I'm like lightly doing it because I don't wanna. And then just tap it so it's again like that like slowly fading to the shimmer like it would collide with the silver one just like that how beautiful uh, how beautiful is that you guys Oof, yes. I'm gonna take Gressa's skin. This is like their lip brush. But let's do Flower Boy. And we are gonna put it right here. Give it a little bit more pigment. Oops, sorry. Give it a little bit more pigment so in the gold could kind of show up just a little bit more. And on the bottom, like right on the bottom of the Right there. I'm gonna go ahead and put IOU. Which is the beautiful orangey peach shade. I'm gonna take that same brush and I'm gonna go back onto the electric palette. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take Revolt and put it right here where it's starting. Get more of all and put it right in the center of the right there right under right in the center and then put it right here in the center just in the center and then in the end right here oh girl yes all right guys so i did my brows off camera I'm not like a brow expert, so I'm so sorry. They're not like bomb.com. So the next thing um, we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to set that brow bone um, area with some white eyeshadow. I'm just taking Blanc, which is a uh, girl, Blanc by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Just a basic white eyeshadow. That's all you really need. Take that set the brow this is how I blend this is like my I guess you could say my trick to blending okay and then you're gonna go ahead and take a blending brush I like to use the morphe e28 brush it's my favorite favorite brush right there my favorite. Now it's like blended. I've decided because I want this to pop out just a little bit more. I've decided to take the this like flat brush. It is by Wet n Wild. I'm gonna go back on to IOU, just in case you guys forgot what it looked like. That's IOU, and I'm gonna dip it in here. And just very lightly follow the line where the gold is. So I'm gonna go ahead and bronze my face with the ColourPop and Alexis Ren palette and it brings this beautiful bronzy shade do you see that lighting beautiful bronze shade which I absolutely love and it brings this really beautiful gold so for the brush I'm gonna use I love using the Luxie 514 blush brush the blush brush I like to take a little bit and then just start. Oof! It's pigmented, so do it with like a light hand. My 
my hairs right here, they look white because of like my foundation. Ah, I kind of look under my nose and on the sides. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take my favorite blush. Yeah, my favorite blush. Okay, it is also by Everyday Minerals. It's the, the setting powder that I used. It is in the shade All Smiles. It is this beautiful peachy, orangey blush. It is my favorite blush of all time. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the Wet n Wild. I believe this is the contour brush. Right on the apples, the cheeks. Mm. And blushed the highlighter, which I'm about to use, is called She's Here to Stay. Yes. She is here to stay. This, this pfft, girl, beautiful gold highlight. I'm gonna use the BH Cosmetics. High, I think this is a highlighting brush in the sh in the shade <laughs> in number seven. I like to put highlight in circular motions. <laughs> I didn't notice how blinding it because I'm like in a different Oof. so flat. I feel like you can see that thing, so I'm just gonna blend it. Sam, honey, she is definitely here to stay. All right, guys, so I did put some false lashes off camera. These are the Ardell, I believe they are the Ar they are Ardell lashes, but I think they're the came, they're like new demi wispy lashes like the professional ones like they're like made by professionals styled by them and stuff oh they're gorgeous <clears throat> um for the lips i'm going to use the sugar pill cosmetics they're it's a matte lipstick it's so pretty do you see it's shimmery oh it's to die for it is in the shade cubby beautiful beautiful like coral pink coral it's basically a flower boy but in a lipstick and a little bit darker put it in the center and then um smudge it out and just know that completes the look are you guys dying because i'm just oof i'm absolutely in love with how it came out if you guys like this video if you guys like me <laughs> definitely like this video comment down below what you guys want to see next and if you guys want to see i don't know like how to how i prime my oily ass lids let me know anything just let me know in the comments below subscribe please if you really do like me ah. for what's this i love you guys already i love you guys so much already ah. i'm excited for this journey and i hope i have people who are actually watching even if it's just one it's all good yeah thanks for watching guys bye